money regardless of whatever else may be going on around you because this is not an unboxing about the Travis Scott one. So let's just put that out there. Now that we've got this all out in the open, let's just get into the video. TJ back with another video talks with TJ aka TJ two swoosh chains over a van's shirt it is what it is leave me alone okay <laughs> back with another video thank you guys so much for rocking out with me on this Sunday this is when I'm gonna try to get this video up on Sunday if you guys are rocking with the channel and you are a subscriber appreciate you you already know I try to engage with you in the comment section always so if you're brand new here and you drop a comment um as long as it's not off the wall reckless you really are making zero sense i will go ahead and respond to it okay try to be accessible in the comment section if you like the video you can go ahead leave a thumbs up on your way in on your way out uh if you don't like it trust me i will not be offended okay you can't please everybody and i don't even attempt to on this channel it's my channel i'm just gonna show y'all what i like and what i have to bring to this space now i do have this unboxing trust i've had this for uh came in earlier this week your girl just didn't have time to get through it hopefully you've seen some of my other videos where i'm really trying to uh, pump out content that is related to money management budgeting and especially related to sneakers as I know so many people are just dropping pickups or they're gonna not be dropping pickups um, I mean when we get to June I've already said this you're gonna understand there'll be plenty of content for you here just not really unboxings of shoes because there's nothing in that upcoming time that I that I want but I did pick up another huh this is my third pair of vans pickup so the shirt should have gave it away this is my third pair of vans pickup uh at this point marcus of the soulmate said you are you gonna get a vans chain i don't think they make a vans chain okay i'll probably just always stick with my nike ones but you guys can see so it's a vans box right i got the vans all over if you're curious which one this is it is the authentic red pair so i think i said this in other videos when i picked up the white pair the red pair is just kind of speaking to me i just i wanted i wanted a red pair so i well tipping over i was able to snag a red pair you guys can see brand new it's the classic red pair with the white laces the white midsole that classic waffle bottom brand new 29.99 on ebay so i don't know how you people don't get this okay ebay is the spot to go for a lot of things this shirt came from eBay and it was $7, okay. So just take out both pairs. I mean, it's, it's nothing crazy. It's nothing, no pun intended, off the wall. But I, I, I know that I can just throw these on. Whenever you have just red shoes, they can pop with anything, okay. And the, the other thing, so a lot of people will complain, of course, like the quality of Jordans is just kind of going down. I think we've known that for a while. But in terms of the demand being higher for these shoes, and I think resale has a lot to do with that, the supply is also going up. Unfortunately, that price is going up, but when that supply tends to go up, you do have a quality control issue. I think that's what we're experiencing with Jordan. Um, so the second you pay 200 some dollars for a shoe and then it looks beat to hell immediately, you're not happy. You're not satisfied as a consumer versus these. The fact that I only paid $29.99 means I'm about to be that upset when these get messed up, okay? throw these suckers in the washing machine or clean them off with some crap and keep it moving so but I got these so if we want to go into others I'm just gonna show you guys some other pickups I got uh, <laughs> this was also a purchase off eBay it's the classic Vans shirt I think I got this one brand new for ten dollars so yeah we're uh we're matchy matchy again Marcus you go ahead and flame me I don't really care but apparently I got the combo all set to go. In terms of some other stuff I got in, I got some Yankee Stance socks in. I actually got these off eBay too. So, I mean, this person was able to pick them up at Ross for $1.99. I think I paid $4.99. I think I paid $3 for shipping. So they got a little bit of a profit out of it. I mean, I got some really cool no-show socks. So I'm with it. I didn't have to pay the $12.99. I would have to pay on Stance's website. Hollister had a sale going on. I didn't have a pair, I needed another pair. I just picked up some classic white jeggings. I feel like ladies, you need to have a, a classic pair of white 
tight fitting pants in your collection, okay? Set off a lot of outfits, or you can just keep it really basic and classic. Like, if you've ever heard the term capsule wardrobe, there are certain things for a classic capsule wardrobe you should just have, you know, whether it's a nice fitting leather jacket, denim jacket, dark rinse jeans, a little black dress, um, a white button up top, like a blue button up top. Um, white jeans are also in there, so I went ahead and got these. The other, the other pair I have are distressed, and they actually fit a little bit big now, so I got my right size of these. So, I mean, I know someone's gonna ask, or whatever. I wear a size three in Hollister jeans, and I wear a size four in um, American Eagle, which is my waist size is a 24, 25. That's right where it hovers. These fit a little tight in the waist, but they fit my legs and everything, so that works. And then I also have this bad boy here. So it's not Hollister, this is an American Eagle. Um, it is a, it's actually a men's extra small. It is a chambray shirt. So, you know, it has that denim feel shirt to it. Clearly it needs to, <laughs> it needs to be ironed. Um, but it has that denim, it has that denim feel shirt to it. This is another capsule wardrobe piece that you should have. So I like this is just kind of, I, I'm not, I don't want to say cliche, all American outfit. But the fact that, I mean, you do have the red, white, and blue, they're going to contrast well off each other. I'll show you guys kind of a flat lay of this, go over the outfit like I tend to do whenever I do pickups. Um, I mean, I just, once again, I have fits in mind when I go to pick things up. This was part of it. I knew I had the band shirt that I had just picked up to go with this, but also just some classic pieces and I mean, Throw these on with a number of things. You can throw this on with a number of things. I would never go with the exact wash of denim for this, but having black distressed jeans, black jeans, khakis, green khakis, you know, a lot will go with it. And then um, just to show you guys, so you know that I plan on picking up those uh, women's black reptile 12s. You know that. So the other, the fitness brand that I um, work with, run one of their pages for, they had a very small Illuminati <laughs> drop release and I actually so I got this this is one of their drops from their uh, this is one of the hoodies that dropped so you guys know I feel like this is perfect to go with those 12s I'm just waiting on them to come the reason I haven't, I haven't really displayed this is because I'm just waiting on them to come go ahead I will make sure I showcase the outfit <laughs> everything but yeah so here it is so those will go perfect with the 12s I just want to show you guys that just quick bands Pick up, uh, I mean, I'll do a quick on foot for you guys. It's not going to be anything crazy. You've seen me already do advance, but this is just kind of the message to drive home. Please make sure whatever you are picking up, you like, you love. I literally had somebody ask me, why would you pick up the all white vans? Because I want it to. Why do you buy anything you buy with your money? Because you personally like it. That's all that matters. I personally like the shoe. Therefore, I spent my money, not your money, to pick up the shoe. That's what you all have to keep in mind. I am not someone on here thinking, I wonder what all of my subs and followers would want me to buy with my income. That's not how it works. And too many get caught up in doing that. And then they have a collection full of, let's be real, shit that they don't care about, don't like, don't wear. That's not what you're getting here. So just, let's just all be aware of that, okay? <laughs> Thank you for rocking with this video. We gonna go ahead, hit the B-roll of the outfit, get you the on foot, and then we are out of here. I hope you have a happy, a good, a blessed, a relaxing Sunday. It is Mother's Day. Please make sure that you are courteous, kind, appreciative, show some gratitude to the women in your life. If it's actually your mom or just a positive mother figure in your life, I mean, moms do make the world go round. If you do not have a great relationship with your mom, I am terribly sorry, but hopefully you have another positive female figure in your life that provides that nurturing, that care, that person you can go to to be able to get, you know, that comforting word, guidance, all that goodness that moms provide. As always, peace out. Thank you.